Okay, now we're into advanced focus mitts. What I'm going to do is I'm going to bring my wife in, Diana. All right, this is what we call the split series. So what we mean by split is, right now let me take this mitt off. If I punch Diana and if she parries on one side of the hand and if she hits me with the other side, this is what we call the split series. So it's a split entry. She's in between my arm. Okay, so everything that we do within a series right now is going to stay with that format. This is how we prefix everything. So when she goes, the first one is she's just going to hit it. Do you see it? Or not, not even the first one, everyone. This is how she starts it. As I punch, she parries and she's going to strike. Right now the mitt represents my face. So we go one, right there. I will step back, she's just going to come in. One, two, three, and then she adds the kick. All right, let me do that again. You see it? All right, so this is our number one. It's pretty simple, you could get this. Just start off slow, right here. Split, one, two, three, and kick. Okay, do it one more time at speed, please. Again. All right, that's number one. Number two, when she does the number two, this time she retains my arm, meaning she stays connected. See how she stays connected? and then she's going to come up and over and hit the mitt and then she's going to cross, she'll hook, she'll cross and then kick. Okay? So what I talk what I mean by retain it, if I were going to use terminology, when she comes in, she's going to lao sing choi. Lao sing choi is actually this hand. So uh, right now, let me set this down. If I go one, see she pushes this back at me and she comes up through the hole and hits. And uh, it could be gua choi, do the gua choi. See, she could backhand. Sometimes she might rake overhead. That's more Lao Sing Choi. So if the hand has a hard time getting through and you just kind of wipe down, that's Lao Sing Choi. So let's do this in a flow. Okay, so one, she comes through. One, two, three, kick. Again. Last time. Okay, that's number two. All right, now when we move into number three, we're going to say that I broke away. Almost like the first one. Remember the one where we went here and I broke away and I just signed the mitt? That's because she had a clear shot at the face. We're going to say now there's an obstruction up. So when she goes one, my hand stays up. We broke away, so now she pocks out. Then she punches one, two, three, and kick. So again, one, I break away, pocks out, one, two, three, Kick. What they'll also say is pak da. Da is the punch. So one pak da. One, two, three, kick. Last time. Split. Pak da. One, two, three, and kick. Okay, that's our number three. Let me swing it this way. I, wanna, uh, I really want the camera to catch all the angles on this. First one. One. She just comes in. One, two, three, kick. Do it again, please. One, one, two, three, and kick. All right, the number two, one, she stays connected, one, two, three, and kick. One more time. See how she stays connected and she backhands, or allow Sing Choi, and then kick. The last one is I break away, and then she catches up with it. One, two, three, kick. One more time, please. Break away, one, one, two, three, kick. Let me add one thing. I'm going to throw a surprise Diana with this, but if she went split entry, and if I backed up too far, don't move yet, she might have to go BUG now tech. Remember our entries? And then go into it. Either if there was nothing there, she would just hit it, or she could pox out, or whatever. But the, uh, the idea is if you feel too much of a gap, instead of just going, whoa, and trying to run in, you could fill the gap with the entry and then go back into it. We're not going to do that now. I just want you to know it. You're an advanced student now. You need to know this. All right? So again, number one. One, one, two, three, kick. Number two, stays connected. And kick. Number three, I break away, my arms up. One, two, three, kick. Now, the number four, watch this. I go one, she goes to do almost like number two, but this time when she goes to do it, I force the hand back up. So now we, we've connected. You ever see Enter the Dragon? Everybody fights this way. Well, this is what they took it from. Nobody fights this way, except during the movie Enter the Dragon. But right now, this is what they call the connection, all right? Or we've bridged, all right? <clears throat> so when we go here, one, she goes come around, I go connect. 
then she pokes out. One, two, three, and kick. One more time. Let me spin you around for this last one. Okay, watch this. So she's gonna go, one, connect, pock, one, two, three, kick. So she goes, pox out, I go up. All right, dead slow. Pox out, and she goes to come over, but I keep the arm up, I get away from her. She clears the barrier and hits, and then goes into her punching series, and kick. Again, slowly, right there, right here. One, two, three, kick. Now at speed, please. Okay, number one, split entry. One, two, three, kick. Number two, she stays connected. Number three, I break away. Pox out, one, two, three, kick. Number four, I meet. One, two, three, and kick. Okay, that's the four at the start. We got more to do, but this is what we call one response back, meaning, uh, or, or a single trap back, because what we do is we go one, and then no matter which one, she does one single trap. One, two, three, four. Stay tuned, more to come.